In the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful. In this video we are going to solve questions of 10th class math, general group, exercise 1.3. So, stay with us. We are going to solve part 1, of question number 2, of 10th class math, general group, exercise 1.3. Question 2, is, simplify these expressions. And part 1 is, under root 2, plus, under root 8. Let's see its solution. We are taking question as it is. Equal to. Under root 2, comes as it is. Plus, comes as it is. Under root 8, can be written as, under root 2, multiplied by 2, multiplied by 2. We are showing you how we write that, take 8 and factorize it as, the table of 2, 3 times divides 8. Equal to, under root 2, comes as it is. Plus, comes as it is. There is only one pair of 2s. So, we take 1, outside of under root. And the other 2 will remain inside the under root. Next, we will take under root 2, common equal, comes as it is. Since, under root 2, is common in both terms, so we take it as common. Under root 2, is common, so 1 will remain. Plus, comes as it is. Under root 2, is common, so, 2 will be left. Equals, under root 2, comes as it is. 1 plus 2, become 3 equal to, here, we write 3 first and under root 2, in the last. This is our final answer. Next, we are going to solve part 2, of question number 2, of 10th class math, general group, exercise 1.3. Question 2, is, simplify these expressions. And part 2 is, 4, under root 50, plus, under root 200, plus, under root 50. Let's see its solution. We are taking question as it is. This question will be solved by factorizing 50, 250. Is equal to, 4, comes as it is. Next, we will factorize 50. Factorization of 50, is 2. 5, 5. The first 2, divides 50, 25 times, next, 5 divides 25, 5 times, last 5, divides 5, 1 time. Plus, comes as it is. Factorization of 200, is 3 times 2, and 2 times 5. First 2 divides 200, 100 times. Then 2, divides, 100, 50 times, then, 2 divides, 50, 25 times, then, 5 divides, 25, 5 times, then 5, divides, 5, 1 time. Plus, comes as it is. Factorization of 50, is 2. 5. 5. First 2 divides 50, 25 times, then 5 divides 25, 5 times, then last 5 divides 5, 1 time. Equal to 4, comes as it is. There is a pair of 5, so we take 1 5, outside the under root. 2 will remain under the root. And 2 under root is written with it. Plus, comes as it is. There is a pair of 2, we take 1, 2 outside of under root. Next, we will take 5 because we have a pair of 5 also. We take a 5 outside of under root. Single 2, will remain inside of square root. Plus, comes as it is. There is a pair of 5 also. So we take a 5 outside. The 2, will remain in square root. So, we write, under root 2, equal, comes as it is. 4 multiplied with 5, becomes 20. Under root 2, comes with it. Plus, comes as it is. 2 multiplied with 5, becomes 10. Under root 2, comes with it. Plus, 5, under root 2, comes as it is. Equal, comes as it is. 
Now, we take under root 2, as common, because, it is present in all the terms. We write 20. Because, under root 2, is common. Plus, comes as it is. We write 10, because, under root 2, is common. Plus, comes as it is. We write 5, because, under root 2, is common. Equal to under root 2, comes as it is. We add 20, 10 and 5, it becomes 35. Here, 35, is written, first and under root 2 is in the end. Hence, this is our answer. Next, we are going to solve part 3, of question number 2, of 10th class math, general group, exercise 1.3. Question 2, is, simplify these expressions. And part 3 is, under root 12, minus, under root 2. Into, under root 20, minus, 3 under root 2. Let's see its solution. We will multiply both these brackets is equal to, under root 12, multiplied with all the terms in second bracket. So, we write, under root 20, minus, 3 under root 2, minus comes from above term. Similarly, under root 2, will be multiplied with terms in second bracket. So, we write, under root 20, minus, 3 under root 2, equal, comes as it is. Next, under root 12, will be multiplied with all the terms in first bracket. And, when we multiply 12 with 20, we see that both are in under root, so we take both in single under root. So, under root, 12 is multiplied with 20. Next is minus, comes as it is. 3 is written as it is. Because it is without under root. Again, under root 12 is multiplied with 2. So, we take single under root and write 12 multiplied with 2. Minus, comes as it is. Similarly, under root 2, is multiplied with under root 20. We write single under root, then, 2 is multiplied with 20. Here, minus is multiplied with minus, becomes, plus which is shown in additional information. Now, 3 comes as it is. Again, we take single under root, then 2 is multiplied with 2. Equal comes as it is. Under root. Then, multiply 12 with 20, becomes 240. Minus 3 comes as it is. Under root. 12 is multiplied with 2, becomes 24. Minus, comes as it is. Under root, 2 is multiplied with 20, becomes 40. Plus, comes as it is. 3. This under root has a pair of 2. So we take one of it. Equal, comes as it is. Next, we will show you the factorization of 240. Consider first 2. 2 1s are 2, 2 2s are 4, 2 zeros are 0. Then, 2 sixs are 12, 2 zeros are 0. Then, 2 3s are 6, 2 zeros are 0. Then, 2 1s are 2, 1 will be left from 3, 1 combines with 0, becomes 10, so 2 5s are 10. Then, 3 5s are 15. Then, 5 1s are 5. So, we take, 2, multiplied with 2, multiplied with 2, multiplied with 2, multiplied with 3, and multiplied with 5. Minus, and 3, comes as it is. Next, we will show you the factorization of 24. The table of 2, goes to 24, 2 1s are 2, 2 2s are 4, then 2 6 are 12, then 2 3 are 6, then 3 1s is 3. Minus, comes as it is. Next, we will show you the factorization of 40. The table of 2, goes to 40, 2 2s are 4, 0 comes as it is, again, 2 1s are 2, 0 comes with it, then 2 5s are 10, and 5 1s are 5. Plus, comes as it is. 3, is multiplied with 2, becomes 6. 
equal comes as it is. There are two pairs of two. So we take two from first pair and another two from second pair. Three and five have no pairs so we multiply them, and answer remains in under root. Minus, three comes as it is. Here we have a pair of two, so we take a two outside the root, and multiply it with three. Two is multiplied with three, becomes six, it remains in under root, because two and three have no pairs. Minus, comes as it is. Again, there is a pair of twos, so we take a two outside the root. Similarly two is multiplied with five, becomes ten. Plus, six, comes as it is. 2 is multiplied with 2, becomes 4. Under root 15, comes as it is. Minus, comes as it is. 3 is multiplied with 2 becomes, 6. Under root 6, comes as it is. Minus, 2, under root 10, comes as it is. Plus, 6 also comes as it is. Since, there is no further simplification possible, so this is our answer. Next, we are going to solve part 4, of question number 2, of 10th class math, general group, exercise 1.3. Question 2, is, simplify these expressions. And part 4 is, 6, plus, under root 2. Into, 5 minus, under root 5. Let's see its solution. We will multiply both these brackets. Equal to. 6. This 6 will be multiplied with the elements present in the second bracket. So, we write 5, minus, under root 5. Then plus, under root 2, this will also multiplied with second bracket. So, we write 5, minus, under root 5. Equal comes as it is. And 6 is multiplied with 5, becomes 30. 6 has no sign sir, this is positive. So, plus multiplied with minus, becomes minus. 6 multiplied with under root 5, becomes 6 under root 5. Plus, comes as it is. Under root 2 is multiplied with 5, becomes, 5 under root 2. Plus, is multiplied with minus, becomes minus. Now, under root 2, is multiplied with under root 5. So we take single under root and multiply 2 with 5. Is equal to, 30, minus, 6 under root 5, plus, 5 under root 2, minus, under root comes as it is. 2 is multiplied with 5, becomes 10. Since, there is no further simplification possible, so this is our answer. Next, we are going to solve part 5, of question number 2, of 10th class math, general group, exercise 1.3. Question 2, is, simplify these expressions. And part 5 is, under root 3, minus, 2, into, 5 minus, under root 5. Let's see its solution. We will multiply both these brackets. Equal to under root 3. This under root 3, will be multiplied with the elements present in the second bracket. So, we write 5 minus, under root 5. Minus 2, comes from first bracket. Again, we write 5 minus under root 5. Equal to. Under root 3 is multiplied with 5. It becomes 5 under root 3. Plus is with under root 3, we multiply this plus with minus present in bracket. It becomes minus, as shown below. Plus minus is minus. Now, under root 3 is multiplied with under root 5. These both are in under root so we take a single under root and multiply 3 with 5. Minus, comes as it is. 2 is multiplied with 5, becomes 10. Minus minus become plus. Here, 2 is multiplied with under root 5 becomes 2 under root 5. Within under root, we multiply 3 with 5 becomes 15. All the remaining terms come as it is. 
Since, there is no further simplification possible, so this is our answer. Next, we are going to solve part 6, of question number 2, of 10th class math, general group, exercise 1.3. Question 2, is, simplify these expressions. And part 6 is, 7, plus, under root 3, into, 5, plus, under root 2. Let's see its solution. We will multiply both these brackets. Is equal to. We take 7 from first bracket, then we will multiply second bracket. We write second bracket. Again, we take plus, under root 3, from first bracket. Here, we write second bracket again. Equal comes as it is. Then, 7 is multiplied with 5, becomes 35. Plus. 7 is multiplied with under root 2, becomes 7 under root 2. Plus. Under root 3 is multiplied with 5, becomes 5 under root 3. Plus plus is plus. Here, under root 3 is multiplied with under root 2. We take single under root and 3 is multiplied with 2. Equal 35, plus, 7 under root 2, plus, 5 under root 3, plus, come as it is. Under root 3 is multiplied with 2, becomes 6. Since, there is no further simplification possible, so this is our answer. You can easily ask questions in comments below this video. Please like this video and subscribe our channel.